sap music. Now drip, 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 drip. 40 drips, one drip of syrup. So I'm gonna pick a spot right there. I think you'll see a drip there. Whoa, dripping like crazy. So I can drive my tap in. It has to be in there good enough to hold the bucket up. We put a lid on it and we let it accumulate. I describe our situation as being property rich but income poor. We don't make a lot of money. We, we make enough to be happy, but you know, it's still not a whole lot more than just a hobby because we're pretty small by New Hampshire standards. But the percentage of my income that I spend on property taxes is much more than my dentist probably. You know, On the farm, we also have horses and my wife also teaches riding. And we, we would be just thrilled if we felt like that would be um, something that we could make a living on. Maybe someday we can do that. Um, but right now we both work other jobs. Well, we've gone beyond the hobby park here. I'm the fourth generation of my family to be working here. And here we offer a lot of maple products, you know, the maple syrup and all the goodies that we can make from maple syrup. Um, our sugar house right here now, we're doing about 4,000 taps. My grandfather he used to have a sawmill, then he sold a sawmill, so he didn't have the access to the slabs. When he first started changing the oil, oil was cheap. It was taking two to three gallons of oil to make a gallon of syrup. You know, now everybody's got jobs throughout the rest of the year, so no one's got the time to make that much firewood. So we just stayed with oil. You know, the price is going is going up. You know, syrup is a luxury item. You know, it's not a it's not like gasoline where we have to have it. You know, no matter what the price is, we got to buy gas to get to work. Well, everybody wanted to go with oil because it's easier. And I said, well, let's stay with the wood. And uh, it's a good thing we didn't because the price of oil was way up. We do buckets and lines. We've been doing it for like 15 years. The sap house up here. It used to be my grandfather's. My uncle has it now. There's quite a few. I don't know, there's at least a dozen in this town, maybe 20 to do sugaring. There's not much money, especially if you have to pay your guys who want work. We do snow plowing, but snow plowing's been a record year, record year, so. Now we're doing pretty good, but we do have to go up a little bit just to, because it's gone up a buck a gallon since last year. But no, it's a lot of fun. Sweet success, makes it good. <laughs>